And Jericho never really got the chance to really prove himself, and I, I thought he could have been a draw. You know, I thought he could have. I thought I could have. Um, I'll give you another great example. Conan, not going to be mistaken for a good worker by anyone, but one of the biggest draws in the history of Mexico, you know, and he could have been a huge draw in the States, like if they'd have given him the ball because his promos, and he talked you into the seats, you know, phenomenal. Um, you know, and I think now, like, he's beat up, he's old, he's not old, but he's beat up, he's older, he's tired, he's, you know, so now he's not even trying to improve his ring work. You know, now, now when ring work's more important, but, um, you know, if they were going to give him a push, I guarantee, like, I, I know enough, like, me and him are close friends, I know enough that I could, I could make you convinced that Conan is a really good worker. Because I could teach him how to hide his bad, his flaws, and how to accentuate his positives, and you would think, wow, Conan's really turned into a hell of a worker, you know? But it's, he's almost like, you know, if they're not going to give him the push, then, you know, why even go to the effort, which I, I disagree with, but, you know, I can understand his point, you know what I mean? Plus, his, his hips bothering him or something, his shoulder, I don't know. Um, but Conan's a great example of a guy who could, he will talk you into the seats. If you, if you put him in a main event position, he'll talk you into the seats, and he's not going to have main event caliber, main event that you would think main event caliber matches, but you'll still pay to see him. So can you give me a basic rundown of what you know it, you think it takes as someone to make it as a, a big star on TV? Basically, you know what, what do they need? What sort of qualities do they need to have? You need to have, okay. You need to be able to talk. That that's so important. You need to have charisma, which is the X factor. You know, some people have it, some don't. You need to uh, be a personality. You know, not a gimmick, but very few gimmicks have ever actually worked. Like the Undertaker gimmick worked, the Big Boss Man gimmick worked, but other than that. The guys who got over were personalities, you know. Flair was a personality, Funk's a personality, Bruno was a personality, Zabisco when he was a draw was a personality, Raven's a personality, you know, these are real life people, Rock, Austin, they're not gimmicks, you know what I mean? And I think that's where people make a mistake, they want to be a gimmick. You know, you have to be a person who's larger than life. Michael Hayes back in the day. Um, I loved Michael Hayes, in fact, Scotty the Body was, I don't know if it was a homage, but like Michael Hayes was my hero, that's who I wanted to be. And one of my greatest moments in my career at that point was, uh, he had, long story short, basically I was at a club, I saw him there, and while I was deciding whether or not to be a mark and walk up and say, I'm a, you know, and bow at his feet, his wife came over and said, my husband wants to meet you. I, Michael Hayes called me over. And, uh, and basically um, his wife's like, oh, this is the guy you make me watch wrestling every day at four o'clock when he is paying for. And, you know, it was like the greatest compliment ever that Michael Hayes wanted to meet me. when. When I stole so much stuff from Michael Hayes, I was like, can you see how I do your stuff? 